right, all right, all right, guys. Happy, happy Tuesday. Happy Tuesday. Hope y'all are doing well. Hope y'all are doing well. This is Paula, DFW's favorite realtor. And I'm in the field today checking in on my client's new construction home. This is a wonderful um, new community. It's uh, cited as a urban community. You have three-story homes, right? They're single individual homes. They kind of look like townhomes, but they're actually uh, single family homes. So this is my client's home. The builder's scheduled to get finished next week. I'm sorry, next month. I see they are uh, finishing up the brick masonry uh, here, right? So they're at the top finishing up up there, but let's go see, see what progress they've made, All right? This is kind of what they look like when they're finished, right? You can see right what they what they look like there but let's go ahead and go into uh go into this one <laughs> you clumsy today girl all right y'all didn't see that <laughs> i fail <laughs> All right, so they are finishing up, right? So I see we're in the interior finish out, finish outside, right? They got doing the finish out. The floors are in. This one's gonna have carpet, so they're gonna be putting in the carpet. All right, it's a three tour, three story home. All right, again, they're single family home. This one is two bedrooms, two and a half baths with the study. Okay, so she's looking good. The lights on. Yep, they are. Okay. So they're working on finish out, right? They'll come and finish out all of that. They got the baseboards, but they'll come and paint them. They'll put floor in this closet. Put carpet in this closet, finish out. All right, they'll do that all in the interior finish outside. All right, once they get that carpet, we'll paint before. We got the knobs already on here. How you doing? I'm just a realtor. All right, we got the coat closet here. All right, this is that um, washroom. This is for a stackable. <laughs> it's a really interesting floor plan. They have two washer and dryer connections. They have one here on the first floor. And then because the owner's retreat is on the third floor, they have it there too. Here's the garage. I love this community. <laughs> I'm just following you because it's rear entry, guys. It's rear entry. This is a two-car garage. How you doing? Get, get, get. I want to show that one that you have available. I'm, I'm finishing up this one and I'll come over in just a minute. Awesome. All right, so here is the garage. All right, let's now let's go up these stairs, y'all. Really unique floor plan. So we saw what was on the first floor, the guest room, the garage. On the second floor, you're gonna have the kitchen and the living area. And a half bath. All right, beautiful kitchen, living and dining. Really tall ceilings. All right. Okay. Really tall ceilings, but they got the floors in. The floors are in. They're waiting on the appliances. Yeah, they're waiting on the appliances. That's where the oven would go. This is the where the dishwasher will go. She's gonna have a farmhouse sink. 
cabinets are looking good. They're all in. So here's that pantry. All right, so this is the dining here, right? Right along here, you'll put your table, kind of farmhouse style. You can put it off on that side or that side, just however she wants to arrange it. Then here's the living area here. <clears throat> Got a window seat, a window seat. So she has a window seat. Right, then there's a half bath here for guests. Right, so there's a half bath here. Right, they have homes like this in the, uh, you know, up north. And so now they're making their way to Texas, right? They're making their way for, to Texas. All right, so up here, we're going to have the owner's retreat and a loft area, a sitting area. All right, here's the sitting area. Straight ahead is the laundry room. Remember I showed you a stackable room for a stackable laundry downstairs? This one has two. The main one is going to be up here for the owner. Right. And then finally, we have the owner's retreat. All right, owner's retreat. Beautiful tray ceilings. A window seat. They got the ceiling fan all in. Now, isn't this a unique floor plan? All right. Got the double sinks. All right, so we got double sinks. All right, she's gonna have a garden shower, big old shower, luxury spa-like shower. Then we have individual toilet, water closet, and then finally, a large walk-in closet. All right, they're storing the extra window here. It's a really great walk-in closet. All right, so they're, they're gonna, we were originally supposed to, they were shooting for the end of the month and then they pushed it, they pushed it, um, actually this week they pushed it to October. So my client's being very flexible and that's the whole thing about new construction homes, guys. You have to be flexible because uh, sometimes they get behind, they get ahead. And so you got to be ready. So when the home is ready, the builder's going to want you to, you know, occupy it almost immediately. Um, so again, you got to be flexible. Hoo, hoo, hoo. Man. I'm so glad we got cooler temperatures here in Texas so I can get my boots back out. Y'all know I love my cowgirl boots. Probably my first day since the summer having on a full pair. Y'all see them? <laughs> but yep, they're wrapping this one up next month. All right, three story. So three story, <coughs> three story. It won't be long before she'll be able to take possession. He he he, let me slow my roll this time. Who who who? Of this way. I wanna go out to the street. What's gonna be my best route? Down y'all. Let's be safety first.
There she is. There she is. All right, you guys have a great one. Five, four, now.